Oh yeah, you beautiful people. How are we doing? Doing well. Hope you're doing well. Obviously today's uh V Day and obviously you know wanna celebrate um all the men, women, even animals like that fought in the wars to get what we've got right now. Do you know what I mean? And uh, you have to be thankful for that. As, um, and I'm probably, my family probably might not be in the country. And um, obviously it went the other way. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? If obviously Germany, Nazi party got control. You know what I mean? You never know. But that's just a never knows. You know what I mean? There's always kind of things on uh, what things would have been like um, if... The Germany with a one. It's only French, actually, isn't it? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? But, um, it, oh, obviously, it's, uh, we also celebrate bit nah, this V day. Get some food, drinks, and some good old, uh, 1940s and 50s kind of music going on. Uh, so, like, celebration music going on, like, was it Vera Lynn? So, which is good, she had a good, quite a good voice. And, um, but yeah, it's uh, that was still a bit of the wax. It's got a bit of wax on my bed still. Um, but yeah, as I say, actually, that's a bit of grey. I don't have to get rid of those. Uh, but yeah, as I say, we spent a bit of time in the garden. And obviously, as I say, I'm trying to sort my mum and dad's and all that now as well. So, if I want these uh, kind of like garden sieves kind of thing as well, which I could put some soil on top and shake it all about and just uh it might probably take me take me a little while so i'm going to do that tomorrow as, as a lot of you probably follow been following me on like facebook and instagram and youtube and stuff i have actually been doing um the garden and repairs around the house and stuff like that as well so it's always easy when we're at work that we um tend I wouldn't say neglect but it just takes us longer to do it you know what i mean so I've just been taking that time to actually go and uh, get things done in the house. Do you know what I mean? And um, uh, like little repairs here and there, little touch-ups here and there. And I probably would have said I'm probably about 70% done in the house. Do you know what I mean? 78% done in the house and stuff like that. And... Um, um, Probably about eight percent done in the garden. It's probably about Jay washing the the floors and stuff like that. But it's not a really uh, necessity to do. But I thought you know what, when I'm off, I might as well do it. So that's exactly what I might just probably do. So I see if I can borrow friends, uh, see if anyone's got one, a jet wash. You know, so I jet wash the floors and all this type of stuff as well. And uh, but yeah, I mean the garden's looking fabulous. I just can't wait to actually. Get some more topsoil, stick it in the flower beds and stuff like that, mix it together, and get some fertilizer and stuff. So, been doing the uh, tackling the glass, grass, grass for the, the lawn for the last uh, week, digging. And I haven't got the high tech stuff, so it's a lot of back breaking, doing the shoveling, all this type of stuff, and digging, shoveling, getting the shit out, all the uh, weeds and stones and all that type of stuff, and I must have went through uh, probably about six or seven inches down, seven, eight inches down, or shit, you know what I mean? And um, and uh, yeah, that's exactly what I ended up like done. And uh, so that's literally done, thing like that. So, right enough, I found uh, one of these like big like sieves that um, my, grand my granddad made years ago, and as strong as anything, do you know what I mean? So. He used to use it himself, and uh, while I was searching for something else, I found that. And so I'll see if I can actually do that, use that to save it into uh, the the grounds. And well, I wouldn't that would be saving me a whole lot more money on buying brand new soil. I will probably end up still getting some topsoil to uh, put on top. Do you know what I mean? So if I can actually just get the uh, save all the crap out, uh, save all the natural soil out of it just keep the crap inside like the sieve box be brilliant you know what i mean and so then all i need to do just get this a fertilized so soil and all that type of stuff as well and then hopefully lay lay the lawn down you know what i mean so it's been a lot of work and lucky enough the grass on my mum and dad's side it's been actually pretty good so i've got this uh four and one grass 
fertilizer seed thing in my bob so I uh, watered the grass early in the morning. I put all the seeds in. That seeds were like top sort of top seeds and all that type of stuff as well, which has actually been uh, do well. So I leave that for about two three days. So I taste Friday. So I come probably about Monday. All right, then I'll uh, water it. All right, then once I water it, then probably water. Yeah, probably water on Sunday because it's said to leave it for at least about two days to settle in. You know what I mean? Gonna leave it for. I'll probably end up leaving it for about three days. Go in early morning Monday, do it, water it, and all that type of stuff. Then leave it till probably about Tuesday. Then mow the lawn. See how it goes. Probably end up leaving it for a week. Actually, yeah, I'll leave it for a week before I mow the lawn because I mowed more than this morning. So, but yeah, it's going well. Do you know what I mean? So obviously, it's, uh, I also want to uh, keep people up to date and see like, what's going on in life and stuff like that. And it's been good. Do you know what I mean? And obviously, I thought, you know what, I'll probably end up getting kind of kind of like depressed type of stuff and uh, what's been going on. But it's been pretty good. I mean, we all have off days. I've been having me off days type of thing as well. And uh, But that's just natural. Do you know what I mean? But I will keep reminding myself just how blessed I am for another day. And, um, is that gone now? It's gone, yeah. Oh, shit, you know what? That's just a grey. Got a grey coming on. Okay, yeah, it was good. Didn't you think it was part of the uh, wax that I put on, but it's not just a bit of, bit of grey. All right, but probably have to wear more paint on. But, uh, yeah, it's, um, yeah, that's what literally what I've been doing this week. And it's been pretty cool. I mean, spending time with better family outside and all that as well, because my old man would usually say that every time he goes out, it starts raining. So it actually didn't rain, but which is good, which is good. And uh, but it did start getting raining. And he was like, see, Chris, I told you, this time we're coming outside, the weather changes or something. <laughs> you know what I mean? Which is uh, quite funny type of stuff as well, isn't it? So I have to say, my bed's actually coming out quite, uh, quite well, you know. I've been doing a lot of work to it. What do you guys think? Leave a comment down in uh, uh, down there, because I mean, even um, all the work that it used to be a whole lot more, able to run my hands through it as well, so which is good. And um, yeah, we're doing a lot, and obviously, it's been feeling a whole lot more better, um, it's softer, and, and all this type of stuff as well, isn't it? So, as I say, been t uh, trying to get more straight solid because I didn't really put the black uh, the cream bomb, which I didn't really put properly. And as I say, trying to grow it more. My tash has actually got an old uh, thicker and stuff like that, and uh, where it's got to this point where I'm actually curl it a whole lot more. And I've had a lot of people actually love the way I've actually done it. Do you know what I mean? Obviously, it's a, a work in progress. You know what I mean? It takes time to actually get get the best I can get it. Do you know what I mean? So, <sighs> tell me, people, how are we doing today? I hope you're doing very well. And talk about totally different things in it and obviously celebrating the day and you know be proud on obviously like where we are right now and for all the work that people done to for us to get where we are now you know what i mean can you, as i say can you imagine if um like the like the nazi party back in the day did win and where we would be Where would be right now? Do you know what I mean? We could have been anywhere, man. We could have been who could have been the prisoners ourselves. Do you know what I mean? Just having all that control type of thing as well. <laughs> but you know, so we have to be blessed that we're all able to do what we're doing and, and all this type of stuff and that as well. You know, so uh, yeah, man, that is a bloody great. I don't think I get on my nerve that is. Right, but uh, that's why I said every single day yeah, is a blessing, so I just have to be keeping going and be happy, you know what I mean? So, being celebrated, took out the pictures, which are stuck on my Instagram and Facebook and stuff like that, so you can actually go on to my Instagram and follow me there. I'll put it down in the comment section. So if you do want to follow me, you can follow me. You probably forget, look, this is there's another video over on YouTube doing videos type of stuff as well, isn't it? You know what I mean? But as I say, man, it's, it is what it is. We can continue going and um, be happy. And I'll probably end up doing another video on uh, my beard and stuff like that. I'm going to do another video on um, 
I had like a type of turbans because I have a lot of people who compliment me on all the different type of turbans. You know what I mean? Especially when it comes to like a special occasion held down in the UK. And I'll do one of my friends was actually Sarah from the Sun American one at the top of the bandana that uh, funny enough I was only looking at that <laughs> through the camera so it was doing like uh was it the Independence Day? Do like an American style kind of like uh thing to my turban and stuff like that as well, do you know what I mean? So and just shows you know unity between people, it doesn't matter who you are, where you come from, what culture you come from, we'll we'll one other day. Do you know what I mean? Humanity came first, all religions came second, and made, you know, the world go into that. But I uh, hope you're doing very well. And uh, you know what, I'm just, I'm just happy, you know what I mean? Got to, got the chance to reconnect with a lot of people over the last couple of weeks. Um, with, like, friends, family, and stuff like that. And it's not the way you want to do it. Obviously, at the moment, we're doing a lot of video calls with a lot of friends and family, and like video calls with like little parties on video calling and uh which we've been doing and making plans to meet up with some friends after this lockdown is done so as i say my words just said it's probably won't get fully on um back to normal to 2021 to be honest and it does look like things are starting to slow down with this corona COVID-19 freaking virus 19 you know what I mean so as I said I don't think Cronenberg uh, Bears gonna might want to change the name don't, it? <laughs> I think, no, don't, don't think anyone want to drink it because every time someone says Corona they're probably like nah forget that you know what I mean but <laughs> but you know, you know what out of days just is what it is man just have to get with it stay home stay safe Help, I'll help all our key workers, you know, chairs, the um, uh, bus drivers, you know, the care homes, everyone that's actually out there doing the job to help us out. And there was a, a thing that I'll see us, that I saw, I think it was on the news or someone told me about it. A lot of the like, nurses, a few of the nurses said, look, as much as obviously it does appreciate, but it's not helping people going out to clapping and all that as well as much as my appreciates you need to stay home stay inside stay stay safe you no know, just they won't keep them coming out to clap because that could actually go and affect because then it could affect people you know, because it could have someone that might have it even if it's a mild one but in a way certainly great i agree you know what i mean i, I mean i'll try my sporting any time i sport where i can do it and all this type of stuff and uh yeah, just have to keep it going. You know what I mean? So keep smiling. You know what I mean? And uh, keep going. And uh, I'm always there for anyone that ever wants to chat. You can message me. You can do what you're doing. And keep going. I hope everyone's having a lovely Friday. And obviously it's a bank holiday weekend over here in the UK. And it is uh, Victory in Europe Day, VE Day. And uh, not only like thing, but it's also worldwide. I would say because you know you have to be thankful everywhere that all the effort that the the good the good guys put out. You know what I mean? You got the good guys, you got the bad guys. Like Razor Ramon, the bad guy, throw his little stick out. You know what I mean? But uh, hey yo, but um, but yeah, listen. Hope everyone has a lovely weekend, and hope everyone gets what they're getting and I pray for the best for everyone and I hope everyone has a big blessing in their life and I hope all this corona virus goes and um, God bless you all see you later you pay for PayPal